Jennifer Forge. Forge. What? Yeah. Welcome back to Gene Forge. We're in the quarters today. People are still crying for help because shit is real. And I am doing it right now. Yeah? Hi. Were your calls for help answered? Nah. Unless you were calling me for help to take you out of this world. Then, yeah. It is very, very typical dragons that the drakes always drop money. Why do they have money? If they were made by shapers, which I guess they weren't, they were made by the outsiders, weren't they? On this occasion. They could have just made them to not want Dosh. The Sholai have had a lot of success bringing in fresh food. Is this why there's been a shortage of food? I don't know if anyone earlier in the game said there was a shortage of food. You know, the, the Serviles talked about how they've you know, struggled their way. They've managed to survive without the Shapers. But only barely. But no, I guess Shapers probably weren't sneaking in and stealing their stuff or anything like that. These books, I don't know, I didn't get to read it before I moved. So let's go back and read it, shall we? These books are mainly fiction and other light reading. Some industrious show I have been using them to learn your language. Well, they haven't done a very good job of it, have they? Maybe they have. Because the only language they're using is stabbing me in the face, or trying to anyway. That sounds pretty human, doesn't it? Sorry, let's not let's not bring that into this. Video games are for fun. Don't need reminders of the real world. Oh, apparently someone does not exist. Actually, I just pressed the wrong button to end combat. Right, empty, empty. Just like my beer gut. Where are you going? Finding a different entrance. Nothing. A whole lot. Oh, hi. Ready to get roasted? Oh, of course a Vlish is standing right there. Right there. Right exactly in my way. Cheers. Could have moved it, but who cares at this point? Most of the group is already dead, so I can't use my AoE. It's just so bloody typical that as soon as the battle starts, that's where he's standing. Stop. Seven gemstones. That's a lot, that is. These must be Drake Lairs. Rich bitches. Oh! This section of the quarters is in ruin. A ruin. No, it is a ruin, yeah. Smashed and hollowed out by reptilian fire and massive di uh, claws. In the middle of the rubble, you see a massive ancient drake. Possibly as old as this complex. When the drake sees you, it says, Come closer, let us speak. But do not trifle with my nest, or I must defend my honour. Does he sound like that? What do you mean, stay back? You said come here. A cat. It's not a cat. It's a drake. This drake is ancient. You already said that. Its skin is faded and cracked. No, that's called scales. And its wings are torn. Yet it has not grown weak with age. Its eyes are alert, and its joints are supple. Hmm. Supple breast. It is easily old enough to have known the shapers before they left. When it sees you, it nods its head, a gesture of respect. Ah, Shaper, yes. It has been long. Yes. I am Akat. I'm not going to do the hisses, that's going to get annoying. I greet you in peace, as long as you do not trifle with my nest. Greetings. No, don't call him creation. Respect. What is your job here? It's a dragon. It doesn't have a job. Its job is to sit on its fat ass. I was set by your kind to guard this place. I lost interest. I breed, oh yeah, now that's a dragon, at times, and set my spawn to find homes on the island. 
and of late I trade knowledge with the Sholai. Don't do that. You've assisted the outsiders? Some, yes. I was bored and their struggles interested me. Who created you? I was made by Danette herself. Yeah, herself. Someone called him... Someone called Danette he earlier. Must have been a mistake, I guess. Master researcher of this island. I have another question. A cat idly picks at a withered scale with its claw. It doesn't seem impressed by you in the least. Then why did you respect me? He should be all high and mighty, as in I'm the greatest, because he is. It's just an objective fact. Tell me about this complex. There is not much you have not seen. How do you know? There's a whole top right corner. And middle. To the to the north is the gene forge. Spoilers if I hadn't already seen it. West of there are holding cells full of rogues. To the west past research are the vats full of poison. Yeah, there's shit everywhere. What do you know of the gene forge? Little. The shapers, they trusted me little. Though they made me for nothing. From nothing. They told me naught of the Gene Forge, for fear I might access it in their absence. As if you need any more power, babe. Um, greetings, creation. I require your assistance, I guess I... Akat chuckles. You see no traces of obedience in its eyes. Shaper, you kind... Your kind lost my respect when you fled this isle. You abandoned me. I see no reason to follow you. I am not one of the pitiful subdrakes you see here. Then I ask for your assistance. Oh. The other options disappeared. You are polite for a shaper. I will give you a little help, but I will let you pr pass in peace. Um, okay, yeah, the other options are gone. They're just gone, unless they come back. Yes, they do. What do you mean by pitiful sub-drakes? The Sholai, they make drakes. They are around. I am... But I am an original, ancient and learned. Or is it supposed to be said learned? I think so. Made by a master shaper with my own will. I do not do not confuse me with them. I don't want to fight him because he's too cool. Look at him. I want to see what you've got though. Um, I'm going after. I'm afraid. Am I? No. Let's just see what he's got. See if it's worth it. Since nothing matters anymore. It isn't worth it. I didn't take anything, don't worry. I just wanted to have a look. To see what you've got. And see just how respect-worthy you are. But then that's disrespectful. Having to see, to believe. The dragon. It's already respect-worthy just for that. So you will respect me, viewers of this video. Or you will be eaten. No, you won't, actually. You don't have to respect me. I'm just some idiot. I'm one of those sub drakes. No, I'm not. I'm not a drake. I'm a drake ayer. I'm a drake who has ayer for everyone around him. No. Is that some booze? Some rubbish ones at that? Two living tools that are not mine. This is a show like journal. I almost misread that as hotel somehow. What the fudge? Or miss saw it anyway. However, it's not a diary of past events. It's more like a lab journal describing your language and that of the show lie. There's even a small shape of show lie dictionary. Whoa! You study the book for a little while. It's very helpful. You now have a better understanding of the show lie tongue. Excuse me, it's text. Just reading it doesn't make you know how to say it and all that. That's like when people say... I don't know. Hideo Kojima. Do they say that? Probably not. But sometimes it is funny, or something, hearing people trying to pronounce Japanese names because presumably they don't watch anime or something so they don't really know how they're supposed to be pronounced but since I do watch anime I usually know how a lot of Japanese names are supposed to be pronounced but some people don't and it's funny hearing how they say it. oh my god it's a reaper at last there's got to be something good in here then 
This door is quite unusual, it doesn't open automatically and there is no control lever, instead you find a small combination wheel. Fortunately the simple device is no match for your intelligence. You open the door. I didn't choose this yet. But yeah, if there's a reaper defending this, it's got to be something even more important than the gene forge in here. Oh! What? Create Fiora? At this point in the adventure? Yeah, they're still one of the best. For looks, anyway. They are adorable. I'd love a, I'd love a Fiora plush. Or something. But these games are too niche to have merchandise like that. Gonna have to get a custom commission one. I bloody would. If I had an income, or like enough of dosh, enough of dosh, to buy a custom plush. I would bloody love a Fiora plush or a Drake plush or something. And then send a photo of it to Jeff Vogel. This is a makeshift restaurant. Ah! For the Drakes, probably. Mm. No, not mmm. Enough of the toilet jokes already. It's starting to seep in and become natural. Oh, a C pin. Right then. Almost done here. And boy, does it look like there's going to be enough time left in this part to go to the Titula area. Titulia. Well, that's rubbish, isn't it? Why was that place so locked up and cheesy? Is that. Oh, what? Where did this door come from? Where's this place? I remember this. Unless I do. I was down here. Oh right, it was uh, Trashkoff's room. I didn't go in because I thought, oh, this is going to be a big important place, isn't it? So let us be very careful. Let's not actually, it's going to be easy. Isn't it? No, no. He's not here. Prob probably. Oh, he has got some turrets, though. Reaper turrets, they would be. Wouldn't they? What are you hiding? There's another one over there. Let's get rid of this one. And then maybe we can kind of get out of the way. It doesn't matter, we're going to kill it anyway. Is that his journal over there? Of all the things he... Oh, good. No, not good, actually. Didn't have enough AP left. Now someone's going to get zonked. 116 damage. How ridiculous. Oh, it's alright when you do 118, is it? Yeah, it is, actually, because I'm the hero. The hero of the day. Oh, wait, that wasn't even half of the Vlish's health. Never mind, it's fine after all. Grounded boots. The cabinet contains personal effects at the random debris of a life at sea. At first it looks like there is little of value. When you Then you notice something poking out from under an old salt encrusted wool cloak. Salt? God, you pick it up. It's an entry baton, you've seen them before, but a lowly apprentice was never trusted to actually hire a bit yet. You already own one. We've seen that before. Should we take a red spore baton? A thard skin tunic? Why does wearing thard skin give you more melee weapon skill? So what would happen if I wore the skin of a cheetah? Would I run faster? If I, or if I wore the skin of a cheetah I would be better at games because I have the power of cheating without actually cheating. This is Trashkov's journal. It's surprisingly short. You open it and begin to read. His large vocabulary, twisted syntax and bad handwriting make it slow going, but you find one section of great interest. Goetch had fled, and he took the gauntlets with him. Plans to lure another shaper here have begun. Is this supposed to be quotation marks? Probably. It's inconsistent. Um, plans to lure another shaper here have begun, but they will take time. I am furious. Now I not only need guidance and assistance, but I will need to regain the gloves. I've got them, so good luck with that. I shoved them up a Drake's arse. 
for safekeeping. The other gloves, the ones I still have, are too damaged. I think Goetch said they could not be repaired, but he may be wrong. He was clear on one point, though. Only with the gloves may the power of the Gene Forge be drawn. I will succeed. I will gain the power, and Goetch will be the first to pay. If I do not kill him, one of my agents will. Didn't I have the fake gloves to give him as well? Or did I not do that? Yeah, fake shaping gloves. Even these have got lore, which should be read. Look at the description, man. Look at the descriptions. There's lots to read, and I want to. But that would be a mighty waste of time, wouldn't it, at this point? Woo! Great, now I'm blocking the door. Oh. Ow! And I'm going to get shot. No, I'm not, actually. I'm going to get shot. No, I'm bloody well. No! Boo! Oh, there's a lot. Okay, so let's uh, do a bit of a... For some reason. Probably because why not? You know? Whoosh. Oh, die. Pish posh. What we got? The cabinet contains a pair of gloves. They're heavily torn. I guess these are the ones that are worn that he was talking about. You're about to close the case again when you realise that the gloves are shaped. You pick them up and inspect them. They are research gloves. They're designed to not just pro not just to protect, but to be a power conduit ready to channel energy into and out of the user. They're incredibly well made. They are also beyond repair. You could make cosmetic changes to make them look nice again, but you would never get them to function. Shaping gloves are very rare, powerful and delicate. They are all too valuable, even in this state, to leave in some dusty cabinet. You take them. Damaged shaping gloves. God, there's so many of them. Guardian Claymore. Strength, quick action, strength of creations. <clears throat> you know what? Yeah. Chonk. Ten lubs. Yummy. Might need to put a couple extra points in dexterity to make up for the loss, but the extra strength. I like to kill things faster. Right then. Um, before I go to the Gene Forge, though, I want to go drop off my stuff. And actually, since I have a uh, nutrient jar, um, I guess I'll go do the one in the guarded docks. There's that one, and the one in the mine core. And what will that do? Maybe allow you to cross the mines? Which no one really cares about, do they? Because they're basically done in there. So let's see what the guarded docks mind does. I'll oh, be careful, this is where there's apparent. Oh, I see them. There's apparently some mines left. Weren't they red? I could get rid of them. There's no point, though. Don't get experience. It's very silent here. Hmm, is it going to be worth it? You guys just wait here. Save my... hello? Save myself some... oh, there must be a door here. Save myself some seconds waiting for you jokers to get out of the way. What can you do for me? What can I do for you? Oh. Feed the servant mind. You open one of the, your jars of nutrients and slowly tip the goo into the creature's mouth. I'll, I wish a drake could tip its goo into my mouth. Oh, while it tries to regain its strength, you clean and tend to its wounds as best you can. Eventually, it returns to consciousness. It is weak and in great pain, but it can speak. Thank you, Shaper. Thank you for saving me. It is more than I deserve. I am Mind Strout, watcher of these docks. What's your purpose here? I was made to watch over the docks, to keep track of numbers and goods and such. 
and to look after things until the shape was returned. I spent much of my time in their absence sleeping. Wise choice, that. What better to do? Then the true light came and I woke back up. Tell me more. There, uh, this was where they landed at first with their ships. I knew they were outsiders and I had to kill them, but I was weak and I was not given the capability to fight well. Did you seal yourself in here? I sent our spies tiny creations to watch them and I tried to develop strength and ways to fight them but then they saw one of my spies listen one of them called Varia she came to me she questioned me she saw I would never help her so I had her warriors beat me oh, so she had her warriors beat me she did not grant me death she thought I might be useful later so they permit they tormented me where did permit come from bloody hell so they tormented me and left me unconscious, and I would have died were it not for you, mighty shaper. Very is dead now. It does not sadden me to hear it. Mind Strout looks up at you gratefully. Yes, great shaper, what now? Tell me about this area, doesn't matter. It was a small dock, supplies were, lo were landed here. That is where, su this is where supplies destined for the research also were taken. Then everything was barred and closed. Now it is a ruin, there are guards, no there aren't. Watching their boat. Very dangerous guards. Not so dangerous. I've been killing a lot of them. Oh, I'm glad. What can you tell me about the research halls? Nothing, I'm afraid. I did not need to know about them. Oh, well, you were useful, weren't they? Weren't you? You're a shaper. Thank you, shaper. I'll try to restore myself. Ah, uh, whatever. I would be... If I was playing it on my own, I'd probably reload it and go use it on the one in the mine as well, just to see what he does, but... We got some lore, didn't we? about Varia, whoever that was. I remember a lot of names, like N Narifa or something, one of the outsiders, who I was coming to find the body of to get something, the key for the sea chest. I remember some things, but not Varia. Very, yeah. Right, well, look at all these... Oops, that's emeralds. Look at all these items that we're going to leave behind. Oh, that's more emeralds, is it? Or... 95 gemstones? Where have they all gone? There they are. There's probably one or two merchants out there that still have some dosh. But I don't care at this point. I don't need it. Can't take it with you between games, unfortunately. Living knife, gold ring. Might as well put that back on, I guess, for now. Don't need these. Just, just use it. Don't maybe need those. Okay. We definitely don't need the spores because we're just going to use the rods, which are basically the same, I do believe. Succor, alacrity, battle. We might as well bring fully charged ones. Well, they didn't last long, did they? I yeah, definitely don't use the the spores then. We're preparing for the final area here, so I'm going to record it. Alacrity battle. Alacrity. Where is defense? I thought I had one. Hmm. Where did they go? Defense. We'll take another defense one if we can. Have we got a full alacrity here. Here we have. Stone Crescent. Wait, we only needed one of them in the end, unless I missed something. Shall we take a green and a brown as well? Maybe. So we've got a red, haven't we? I don't know if we're going to need them in there, but... There you go. Guess I'll bring some essence thingies just in case. Probably won't need them. What else? Restoration spores, why not? Um, probably won't need any more thingies. Living tools. Alright, well there you go. We're all ready, I suppose. There's probably some people I could go talk to, to get a bit more lore or something. Because now that I've found places and done stuff, like maybe the outsider in refugee cave but we're going to gene forge 
We'll start having a look for these last minutes of the part. <clears throat> this is the main presentation hall of the research complex. This is where the most valuable, most exciting creations and inventions were kept and showed. This is not a ruin. This area is still very active. You can hear the humming of crystals and power spirals, and the growls of creations. There is a hint of ozone in the air. Oh, the ozone layer has come down from the top of the sky. This is the centre. Whatever Susi Island's true purpose was, it is here. And it is time. Is it going to be hard? Probably not, because I am almighty. It's one of those games, one of those rare games where instead of the way JRPGs do it, where if you've done the optional stuff, you're you're already strong enough to do anything else in the game. But in this game, I mean, you probably are strong enough to do everything else in the game as well, but the power you get from the optional stuff will, will actually help instead of just being pointless. Rocks in a tube. Look at all these canisters. What? Oh, right. There were two entrances. I thought there was going to be another place after this. Might as well circle the whole area. Guess Trashkov's going to be in the middle. And it better not just be the final battle already. That'll make for a silly final part. If it's just five minutes of battle, I'm sure it'll make up for it in reading the endings. I'm hoping I get the option to use it or destroy it. I'm going to try and get like as many different options going on as possible so I can show different endings. You know, not going out of my way to do everything. Bloody hell, he's used a lot. Fatty. Okay, there are no other exits. I'm not going to go out of my way to do everything. Every possible different thing I could, but I'm going to do the one or two that I can. Maybe even three. I want to give him the fake gloves. I want to give him... I don't know. I'll just, let's just have a look, shall we? See what we can do. Oh, here we... Oh, gear we go. Here we go. Da -da -da -da. Let's do another one, like... Final... Jeez. Here we go. You step into the main presentation hall. It's a huge stone hall with a high arched roof. The most significant and impressive developments were given their first viewing here. Even centuries later, the air crackles with magic. Oh, there's a storm going on in here. In the centre of the room stands a lone figure. He's not a large man. Yeah, he is. He's eating all the canisters. In the centre of the... Oh, what? Oops. Yeah. He has visible muscles, but he is nothing like the charged, augmented behemoths you've seen elsewhere. His eyes are calm, not arrogant or deranged. This must at last be Trashkoff, leader of the Sholai, who have invaded your land and stolen your secrets. He makes no move to attack you. He simply waves you forward. He wishes to parlay with you. I'd rather part, eh? But not here. Push you into the gene forge. I wonder what would happen. You'd probably shrivel up into a noodle beast. He seems unafraid of an attack. Considering the size of the massive fierce creations which stand around the perimeter of the room, you can see why. <laughs> yeah, 320 health. Oh god, that's scary, that is. Yeah. How many you got, eh? One, two, three. Four. Hang on, what else we got around here, eh? Show like painted something on the door. Beware. Oh, yeah. We'll see about that, won't we? No, we won't. There's nothing in here. I don't care. What is there to beware in here? Oh, yeah. Nothing, yeah. Is it just going to make everyone angry? Probably not. He wants to... Oh! Mad Drake. Me. I'm pretty mad. See? What happened here? 
Oh, ow, my munch device. I mean my, I don't know. Munch device, as in my penis munches things, no. Heavy boots, what? Dude, what the hell? There was nothing in here. Worth being in here for. Yeah, I wonder if there's some lore behind that, like maybe that was a creature they used for something. Some kind of experimental cheesums. Great, now I've had to waste some essence. Oh, there he is. 800 health. God, I thought mud crab's more fearsome than you. I have actually. Gene Forge, do not enter without Danette's authorization. Oh, I thought the Gene Forge was going to be in here. Oh, we're just going to circle the room before we do anything. I think the first thing I'm going to try and do is enter the Gene Forge, see what happens. Maybe I can tamper with it. Tampa Bay. Yeah, you've got like fuck all, mate. You got six creations. Wow. Yeah, thanks for watching. Next time, we'll be doing all this, won't we? Might be the final part, it might not be. See, it might be. Thanks for watching, goodbye.